electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Guess I was wrong. Can always look for another shop where they won't ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border. That's fine. Step aside. What? Got any idea what to do? <clears throat> hmm. Huh. I'm gonna bypass the coupling and rig a hot wire. Compressor will run on and on. It could seize up. Did anyone ask your opinion?
see what happens. You know, I don't have all day. No. Not shabby at all. Questions how long it'll last you. It'll get me to Night City. I figure something else out there. Right. You're wearing on my patience. I'm looking for someone. Jackie Wells. Have you maybe... So doable? It sure was. Satisficing that. Not a solid fix. Might as well have used spit and duct tape. It worked. That's what matters. Antenna on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. Not liable to him much. You don't say. Hey, Mike. Didn't know you had a customer. Uh, rolled in a few hours past. I I, I thought uh, he'd at least called in. Don't you swear to Mike. We're gonna hash it out. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. I can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver showguns? Ring any bells? Good evening, I'd say. Our special Don't like to get along, do ya? That a nomad vehicle? Might have expected that. If you have a problem, I'm willing to hear it. Let me tell you what my problem is. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Where'd your clan pitch camp? There is no clan, there is no camp. I'm here alone. I ain't buying it. Nomads always stick to their packs. My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Sure as hell hope you'll be on your way before long. I saw broadcast in comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down, and I need to radio someone. What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? What? Suddenly all shy. I've made it clear. I don't want any trouble. Then stop looking for it, and hit the road, quick. Drive rigs for sub oil. Lousy stint that was. <laughs> Bit it padded your pockets, though. Sure, but imagine hauling a tank of rocket fuel across two states.
Come in. Ah, raised you finally. Willie McCoy, it's good to hear your voice. Fee, wish I could say the same. Why can't you? You abandoned the clan. I can't help you anymore. I never knew you to be so cautious. Try and loyal. Rules are rules. The system won't work without him. It can't. Nomads get the work in these parts because it's nomad turf. Wouldn't be a problem if you're still a backer. You should have stuck with them, and joined up with the Snake Nation like the rest. Snake Nation can kiss my ass. I need your help. One last time. One last time? Again? I have to find the client with my payload, but I don't know where he is. Hmm. Right place, right time. You were there? My car gave out. The electric coupling. It's a miracle I made it here. Maybe the client left a message. Could you check for me? Hmm. Sure. Last time, though. I mean it. Client's name? Jackie Wells. Huh. Actually left a message. He's waiting on a farm. Flicking you the geolope data. Thanks, Willie. I owe you one. You do. Just don't get yourself killed. And don't call again.
Soft slacker, another fucking weasel. I feel good about this. Do I know you? Well? Watch up. You from around here?
was worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. Are you Wells? And Jackie, por favor. I'm V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. Oh, where I'm from, you share a bit about your soul before you talk biz, eh? It's kind of like a custom. Or just good manners, you know? You're a man of principle? You need a backbone, cabron. At least you'll have that left when they've taken everything else. Why don't we start with you, then? NC native, right here. Got Haywood in my blood. I've never been to NC. That doesn't mean much to me. So, imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a <laughs> distant cousin, at least. <laughs> I think I understand. You don't have to like each other, but it's family. That's Haywood. That and everyone's back in iron. And you? I guess one could say I'm from my own Haywood. You and me, we're gonna get along fine. The cargo. What's inside? You sleep better the less you know. I got no idea myself, and that's a good thing. You don't know what we aim to smuggle? These are stolen corporate goods. Stolen? No. Oh. Some gonk lost the crate. Some other gonk found it, passed it on. Now it's here. You know, butterfly effect or whatever. And there's no one looking for this crate? Ain't a problem if they look. Only a problem if they find it before it crosses the border, no? Let's load it in the car. A huevo. Started thinking you might not come. I got held up. And you weren't exactly easy to find. I decided to lay low, you know? The sheriff looked like one grouchy motherfucker. Yep. So, we headed out? the manifest from the transport? Of course I do. But the fixer didn't give you the job deeds? He... he did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? We ain't lost, are we? Hey, you, uh, sure you've moved contraband before? Why, are you nervous? Me? <laughs> ah, por favor. Well, uh, 
Maybe a little. Scan us and check our papers. <sighs> okay. I'll do the talking. Please direct your vehicle to the inspection area. Remain in your vehicle. The security check will begin shortly. I got a real bad feeling about this. You know they'll notice if you're nervous, right? You have to calm down. Right, right, yeah. Hand me the manifest. Don't need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. <laughs> it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. It means the cargo is flagged as to be lost as soon as it crossed the border. Oh. So they know we're smuggling. They're about to find out. The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. Chingana madre. What now? Relax. It's all in line with procedures. It's all part of the plan. Hey, guess you know what you're doing, huh? We want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docus. We'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Right. You forgot. I'll keep the engine running, in case of a cock up. Do that. Proceed to customs without undue delay. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Now please report to room number two. Room two. How'd you wind up here, in this city? Please sit.
Papers. I know the rules. Everything's there. It might be. It might not be. We'll see. Hmm. What are you transporting? It's all in there. Everything? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which Nomad Clan? None. No clan. I drive for myself. Bold. And none too wise. You know, whenever I see someone like you, I'm oh so grateful not to be on that side of the table. The feeling's mutual. Go on now. Your associate's waiting for you in the car. Don't forget to take your personal items. It's important, important that you're good. Hey, friend, you good? Be careful with that toy, and welcome to Night City. Those little shits imagine Night City is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Young, naive, which is just a euphemism for ignorant. What happened in there? I'll tell you soon. We need to get out of here. Yeah, okay. You gonna tell me what happened back there? <laughs> Let's say I have a bad feeling about this. Oh. Happened a lot to you? Rarely. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie, just drive. Someone's coming our way. This does not look good. Stop your vehicle immediately. Let's get out of here. On it. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. Damn.
driving. We can't stop here. Place looks deserted. I'm gonna stop here. I need to sort out a few things before we go on. Fucking hell. hijo de la chingada madre! They almost tagged our asses. That what you call smuggling? Chingado! Was supposed to go smooth. No problems. Calm down. Sometimes these things happen. This? What kind of shit happens? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please? With no consequences. He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us. And he was right. <sighs> so what now? We've crossed the border. Now you pay me, and we go our separate ways. Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I'm a bit light. I can't pay you now. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corporal crap we're carrying. Huh. And you just figured I would sit by patiently. Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. I was just gonna bust ass and disappear as soon as we crossed over, but... You're all right. I appreciate the honesty. Yeah, thanks. So, what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Open it. I don't know if your client's gonna be happy getting an open package. It usually means trouble. Fuck the client. You gotta start working for yourself sometime. No commission, no middleman. And I need to know what I'm selling if I'm gonna try to find a new buyer. Aw, oh, shit. It says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. Then maybe we'll make some heavy money. No mames. A real iguana. A, uh, lesser Antillian, I think. Lesser until what? Yeah, I watched the thing on TV about them. Went extinct like 30 years ago. They're from the Lesser Antilles. You come a long way, my scaly friend. You think you can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half seas. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gonk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you, uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? Why do you ask? Because I got this feeling you got a lot of time and nothing to spend it on. And NC ain't a city that lets you get by without buddies. But don't you worry. Let me help you find Diggs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know, like, uh, family. Maybe you'll find your own down in Night City. Thanks. Much appreciated. Hey, come on. It's nothing. We got chemistry, you and me. Be a crying shame to waste it. Partner. Hey! Oh, cuddly little fucker. You know what, Jackie? You're not all bad yourself. <laughs> you don't mean that, mano. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. Another day ahead of us in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means 
a hundred new arrivals. But only half these gods will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Black Hand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the bounty, kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. NC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. Matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams. I think we're looking for her somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Militech? Jack, we're talking classified military grade shit here. How'd you get it? T Bug. And our girl made a couple adjustments. Why? Think she knows better? Nah. Said it didn't suit her, uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Sure. Why the hell not? So? Not bad, huh? But now we can get down to biz. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Make moves, Mano. Movie. Your movie. V. Targets Sandra Dorset. Target's Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Calm the hell down, both of you. Almost there. Yeah, Bug. You focus. Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomon. Fingers crossed it's not too late. So you oh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? late. 
Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking.
sensors. Looks like you got them. You're clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. <sighs> this does not She's look in the tub good. of ice. Crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. When people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. That ever known why. You'd be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, jack into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that Biomon working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the Biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, hermano. Do your thing. Ah, oh, fuck! She's flatlining! V! Jackie, air going. hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Hey, catch, vato! I think... Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabron. Get her outside. Mm. Scav rats abandoned in ship. Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Back. Now. 
TT-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Brennigan. Show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's it gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. Saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. She'll get Wakako on the hollow. Tell her the job's done. She's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? 
Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. City like any other, just bigger. No, mano, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Whelan, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Man, I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie. They're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, man, you're right. Is it just me, or... Oh, you can do it. Hello. I don't like it. I don't want to you did. Scum! You hold that boat down! Fucking drive, Jackie! Come on, B! Shoot! Can't! Keep her steady! Focus on getting home. On lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measures. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. 
Let them through. But they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. She took a liking to you. The devotion I demonstrated grabbed her by the gun. Right. I'm loyal, stable in my affections. Mm-hmm. And unassuming. You get it. your average badges. That's Magstack. NCPD's Apex Predators. MTAC rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gonk's out there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Chill, V. Don't let me through. Sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Dreams then. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Ahí luego. logistics center. The city government has openly considered selling the land for a single euro dollar in a symbolic gesture, provided that Kang Tao demonstrates commitment to eradicating the district's criminal presence. Today's final story is an unwelcome one for pet owners. The king will increase to 1,000 euro dollars per dog per month. Similarly, the fine for possessing an undocumented animal will increase to 40,000 euro dollars. Thank you for tuning in to the N54 local news. Have a pleasant day.
Good evening, Night City. My first guest tonight is the president of the Church of Elmo. Bug. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to thee, our Father in heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip In program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. How's luck like treating you, beautiful? Can't complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Now, I'd like us to talk about the most exclusive and highly sought after implant on the market today, Arasaka Corpse Relic. But maybe we ought to make sure our fair audience is up to speed. Karina, what is Relic exactly? In a word, if you could. In one word? I'd say immortality. Immortality? Really? That's right. Relic allows you to transfer the consciousness from a dying person, finding a new home for their soul on a transferable chip. This person, they'll never leave your side, a companion forever with you in your own consciousness, just a... Child, child, think for a moment about what you're saying. This relic is an abomination that feeds on human misery. It is an unnatural likeness, a golden calf born by false prophets. Arasaka speaks of preserving the soul. But they can promise nothing more than a heartless, mindless algorithm speaking with the voice of the departed. What's more, this technology is just another tool of coercion and corruption. Only the wealthy and powerful elite will have access. And they will pay any price in exchange for a chance at this so-called immortality. Well, that is true that Arasaka Corp has specifically limited access to the relic in order... Your promise is a lie. An evil lie. Motivated by greed and... <laughs> now that is rich. Hey, excuse me? False promises, greed, a lust for power. Why, it sounds an awful lot like a church. What? How dare you? Do you not promise a life after death? Do you not charge funeral fees to a family in mourning? Maybe the Reverend is just afraid of some healthy competition, huh? Competition? You believe everything in this world can be counted, measured, rationalized. And wouldn't we be right? We can construct artificial brains, create new consciousness. But I ask you why? What does that give us? Are we as a people on this earth any happier for it? You claim that this relic gives eternal life. But all I see is an eternity of suffering. Rather than say goodbye, we haunt ourselves with their voices, their presence. What do you folks think? Who holds the truth? Is it Ms. Lee or maybe Reverend Culver? That is up to you. Send Culver or Lee to 7892 to cast your vote and enter your name for a chance to win tickets to this year's playoff. Ziggy! Until next time, Night City. Toodles. to the World Report on N54 News. The Western Corporate State recently announced a new visa program. Persons intending to relocate there must first find a sponsor from among WCS affiliated companies. Following a 20 year employment period within the WCS, visa holders can earn the right to permanent residence, a marriage license, and a single child permit.
I don't recognize you. Just passing through. <laughs> 